Hello! Hello! Yes, and welcome to another Kids Doctor. And I said that's so Scottish, it's weird. Okay. Okay. Hi. Okay. Hi. Hi. If you want to find out um, how I deal with Glaswegian words and phrases, there's another video for that. I'll leave a comment down in the description. Anyway, welcome to another Kids Doctor. Hello. And today we're talking um, and watching about uh, another kids TV series with Jamie and Fraser. Hello. Here one more Hello. time. Hi. And um, we're here for a series that was broadcast originally on the BBC, BBC One in 1986, ran for 25 episodes and was made by the same guys who made The Family Ness and, and Penny Crayon. Penny Crayon. So let's go and do a bit of Jimbo and the Jet Set. Where we take off? Oh, a bit of retro. Oh, wow. Okay. Back when Kid Telly was good. Oh my God, it's Andy Crane. How are you today? I trust I find you fit. Where's Ed? Good. I'm glad things. Where's are Ed the Duck? I'm in a good. I'm in a really oh no, good that wasn't today. Oh, I'm not going to do it. Yeah, yeah, do it. Yeah, and I used to have an Ed Duck as well. Yeah. I'm not going to because I'll get told off. I have said <laughs> I'm going to show you this card that Amber has drawn for me. This is great. Just dear Andy, I love children's BBC. Would you, you like the play? Oh, we've got, got a little bit extra here, Kid Stock, to this time, guys. I mean, it's just a bit of nostalgia. I'm loving the, I'm loving the, uh, the Garfield behind the him. Mm -hmm. In which the card. Super, oh, just super Ted, Ted, yeah. There it is. Could Dear Post Office, office. I am I'm sorry, sorry. I do not know, I don't know the full address, but. But I hope with your help it will reach the right place. Thank you. Yes, in fact, I don't I know don't... any of the address. That comes from Miss Amber Knights. The front of the envelope they said Andy Crane. looks like a guy. Was it found it? Oh, amazing that it got to you. I don't know why I know him more for bad influence. The, the, the computer show, Have a look at this computer one. This is game, game show. I don't remember that. The the review show in the 90s. Wow, no, I don't remember that. He is on, he, he's a radio presenter. He's the GPO, a very nice people. He's um, the GPO. That shows how long ago it was. From the general post office. Thank you. Well, thank you for writing to us. <laughs> so what you saw is as 86. Wow. 86, 87, that makes sense. Answer. One of the things on my mind, anyway. What do they do with all the rags you're sending to the rags appeal on Blue Peter? I mean, I don't even remember it being Before called that, the GPO. You in a tick. The chuckle hands yeah. at four o'clock. There's Super Ted at five past four. George's <sighs> Marvellous Medicine continues at 4.15. We go around the world. We've done the video for that, haven't we? 425. Maybe. Maybe. It's coming up. It could have been already out by now. Yeah. Depends on what you do. What is it, James? No. So you don't remember this? I vaguely remember when it's... Oh, I love his little feet! Jimbo! They look more like dogs and sheep. Jimbo! It's coming back to me now. Jimbo! Jimbo, Jimbo, Jimbo. Cut it up. I knew this one that had a bit of a Oh, oh, he's not going to make it. Oh, he's alright. Oh. I mean, if you did that every week. It had been a very quiet morning on the airport. <laughs> Air yeah. Very the quiet morning the at the airport. Broke the silence. Jimbo, stand by to take a VIP on board. You're about to leave on a very special. Oh great! I like special missions, Chief. Susan so Sheridan. Is very important person too. It's top Not to be confused with Sheridan Smith, as I I'm thought whenever I did the description earlier. I recorded message as soon as you. Don't you think he's just doing this to get voice? Yeah, I'm trying to think. I've heard that right voice before somewhere. Sunset. It's not Michael Caine. What's Peter Hawkins again? Is it Peter Hawkins? Probably where I'm And remind the people at home. Peter Hawkins is the Doctor Who and Doctor Who 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 don't switch on my recorded message until you are clear of lying. Off you go now! I'm on my way, Chief! Off goes Jimbo. Oh, I, I mean, if that's just one person I mean, that's, and one way, the, the fuel economy is yeah, atrocious. Yeah, it also sounds like um, Dennis the Menace. Hello, Jimbo. This is your Chief Controller speaking. This is your recorded message. You are to switch to automatic The fact it's stuck out the top of his head and he's just happy to go ahead with it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this is what we call gaslighting. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is the end 
of your recorded message. Well, I'm all right. I don't know where I am, but I'm here. I don't know, I can hear a helicopter. It's the control tower. They must have brought it all the way from London. Jamal, are you receiving me out there? Chief? Is that you, Chief? Or is it another recording message? I just realised it sounds like George from George and Melton. Melton? Come on, very own control tower. You don't really fly your voice while you're in that control tower, Chief. Never mind about me. What you're about to see is so secret. Must people tell me about it when you get back to London Airport? You can rely on me, Chief. I mean, he brings that a microphone, he doesn't see that. Are you not going to move out of the way so you don't get blown up with the rocket fuse? This is exciting. I'm about to witness a rocket flight into space. Hiya. I mean, we're... we're... Oh, Jamal, you're going to have to stop that. Jamal, you're going to have to stop that. Jamal, you're going to have to stop that. What was what, what wasn't they say? Oh, dude. That's not fair. I've waited years to go into space, and that stupid chief of yours beats me to it. He's not even trained. <laughs> oh, come on, Mr. Astronaut. Get aboard and I'll fly you home. Back to London Airport. Oh, Hello, London Airport. Permission to land, please. Hello, is that you, Jimbo? It's Tommy Door Truck here. Can you hang on a moment? We're waiting for the control tower to land. The control tower? Hello? Hello? Permission to land, please. This is Grand Control to London Town. Control tower to land before me, Chief. <laughs> Come on, Chief, hurry up. I've got an astronaut on board. He's very upset. I'm half as upset as I'm going to be when I get down, Chief Bobber. Jim Barrow. Somebody's in for a rocket, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that doesn't even make any sense. Peter Maddox. So, my complaint is, how do they justify the money spent on um, sending one person on a private plane? If that was indeed a private plane, that's a waste of resources, I think. It is a waste of resources, yes. <laughs> Jamie? Uh, that, was, that was very interesting. That was yeah. grand. Uh, it's the quietest he's been in all the ones we've recorded it. He obviously enjoyed that one the most. Yeah, yeah. It's it's very, about... very clean. <laughs> it's a very clean Jamie yes. reaction. It was, that apart one. from the, the rocket joke, you didn't even pick up on the big rocket. I know, yeah, I'm surprised that's... that you're not picking up on big rockets, Yeah, Jamie. well, that's a bit too on the nose, you know. So <laughs> I personally didn't see the control tower getting launched by mistake. No, I didn't. Because either. there's no way that that uh, control tower had rocket capabilities. Yeah. Otherwise, they wouldn't need to have helicoptered it in a whole building on one helicopter. Yeah, yeah so it's, it subverted our expectation there, and that was what made it funny. But I think they should reboot Jimbo. Bring it back. Yeah, bring back Jimbo. Bring back Jimbo. So hashtag, there we are. hashtag bring back Jimbo. Hashtag bring back that Jimbo. That could bring yes. up some very uh, dubious. To be his um, result. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, I, I haven't thought of that before. I said that there. Bring back Jumbo the jet engine. Well, that was quite fun. I, li I like that. I like the the joke, the rocket joke. I did like that. Right? Yes. All I could think of when Jimbo was speaking was Dennis the Menace. Yes. Also did voiced the voice. by Sophie Aldred. Yes. Yes. But it was very similar. Yes. Yes. To what Sophie Aldred did. Yeah. Um. So, but yeah, that was that was more recently. She did that one too. Yeah. Yeah, there you are. That was Jimbo. That was Jimbo, that yes. Uh, leave a comment down below what your memories of Jimbo are. Just let us know down below as always. If you like this video, don't forget to like it and share it with the hashtag TeamStructor. I know they said the wrong thing there again. <laughs> it's the second video in a row. Anyway, um, so yeah, if you like this video, don't forget to like and share. Um, uh, the rest of the Kids Doctor series is up in the corner. That corner, I think it's that corner. Um, and um, if you like this channel as a whole, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notifications bell. Bing! So you know when a new video comes out. Um, a new video in general, Sunday 4pm GMT. I'll see you next week with another video on the channel. Until then, thanks very much for watching, guys, and we'll see you later. Thank you for flying Team Structor. Airlines, we hope you enjoyed your flight. <laughs>